clients still don't even realize that they have to declare their tax but what is happening now is it's coming up on flagging with the ato that they have crypto and that they may have held or disposed of crypto so that's the first thing or they might have forgotten um, that they were uh, investing or um, having transactions in crypto so first thing that we've got to do is just understand how many exchanges they have been on a lot of clients hopefully they've just used one or two but uh, a lot of the times they have um, dabbled across multiple different platforms some of them have potentially uh, they've lost information so one tip that i would say to clients is make sure you're keeping records make make sure you're going with reputable exchanges as well because there's no excuse the ato is not going to accept an excuse oh something happened i can't find it um, so I would be making sure you're keeping your records and then we have specialized crypto tax software that we use that we um, feed through all of the data and then work through the errors and the different the, it, there's potentially lots of different things that come up and we work through those with the clients to get an accurate result as possible um, and it depends on how many transactions they've had as to how complex this can be certainly if it's easy we'll make it as easy as possible for you and then if we've got clients that are trading and that um, definitely is like hundreds of thousands of transactions that we sort of help sort them through but we do it in an effective way where it's not manual some accountants still want to manually try and calculate all of this but we do uh, utilize specialized crypto tax software to help us in most cases